What they tell me is that the New York water has something to do with the texture of mm. the bagels. Can you just say water again? Water? <laughs> <laughs> My roots are showing. <laughs> I'm Nicole Wilhelm, your Bay Area host for Five Buck Lunch. Having lived in the Bay Area my whole life, some would call me a unicorn. As a real native should, I've got all the Bay Area spots for cheap eats. Let me take you on a magical journey from hangry to happy for five bucks or less. ourselves in Temescal, an Oakland neighborhood, which is the hub between the East Bay and San Francisco. I know what you're thinking. She looks hungry. And <laughs> you're absolutely right. I am super hungry. And today I am craving bagels. Now, when you think Bay Area, you might not be thinking bagels, but you should. I know you think oranges, sourdough, E40. Now, Cody, I know you've never tried Oakland style bagels, but I challenge you to an East Coast, West Coast battle of the bagels. Now, let's see what Oaklanders have to say about their bagels. Sabrina. Yeah. That's a very unique name. Thank you. My parents made it up. What inspired them? I guess the acid trip in the <laughs> late 60s. What kind of bagel would you be? I'd be uh, poppy seed with cream cheese, lox, mm -hmm. and some capers. Me too. But I'm really a croissant man. What type of bagel would you be? I'd be an egg bagel. Oh. I like egg bagels. They're a little like sweet. <laughs> like you. Like you. Yeah. <laughs> what type of bagel would you be? Love and everything bagel. And everything. <laughs> everything. Everything. More is more. <laughs> oh, okay. Now, if you had a choice of Bay Area bagels versus New York bagels? I think it's New York bagels. Oh. Jesus, uh, from the East Coast, they're probably New York. I would have to say Brooklyn, just because that's my, my birthplace. And I grew up on Brooklyn bagels. If you had to choose New York over the Bay bagels. Now that we have beauties, I would say the Bay. I really love that they use organic flour and that the bagels are wood fired. Do you hear that, Cody? Somebody picked the Bay. West Coast versus East Coast battle, what's up? West Coast. <laughs> Isn't it crazy that everyone we came across was from New York? What are the odds? Did Cody, did you, did you plant these people? And it's also crazy that everyone seemed to be saying that they would be an everything bagel. I guess it's like Lauren Hill said, everything is everything. So we're here at Beauty's Bagel Shop in Temescal. Let's see how they do it, Oakland style. Hey, it's so Hi, cool. hello, nice to see you. So can you tell me a little bit about your bagel shop? opened this about six and a half years ago. We make everything from scratch. We retard the dough to a more complex dough, and then we boil it in honey water, toss it in seeds, both sides, and then we bake in a wood-fired oven. So what's the most popular dish here? Uh, I would say our fried chicken. If the fried chicken wasn't an option, what other choices would you have? The shakshuka. It's a Middle Eastern stew made with tomato, peppers, onions, garlic. Crack a couple eggs in there. Top it with za'atar, which is a Middle Eastern spice blend. And it comes with a buttered bagel of your choice. Delicious. So I don't know if I can afford all of that za'atar. All right. Um, so what can I get for five bucks? I would get a an egg sandwich on an everything bagel. I'll do that. Great. Thank you so much. egg sandwich on an everything bagel. I feel like we have an instant connection. Is it too soon to say that I love you? Let's take a bite. That's the one. We're gonna go together. I love the fluffiness of the eggs, and I also really love how chewy the bagel is, but it has a slight crunch as well. And notice how each of these bagels unlike New York style bagels, have a hand-shaped figure. And they bathe in honey water. Not regular tap water, but honey water. I want to bathe in honey water. I love all the seeds on top, from the sesame seed to the poppy seed. And I also really enjoy, is that garlic? Mm, mm-hmm. Mm. So good. They make these bagels fresh every morning, and they close at three. So make sure that you come early so you don't miss out. Let's try the eggs. So fluffy. Do you see that fluffiness? Yes. Mmm. You know, I normally don't like things when they're beaten, but this egg is delicious. What are you guys still doing here? Don't you have somewhere to be? I mean, this is amazing. You should come out and get some. I'm sorry. The truth is, is that I really want to be alone with this bagel so I can make sweet love to it. So go somewhere. Thanks. 
Before I forget, remember to stay hungry and hustle, but full enough to give to others. And also, remember to subscribe, comment, like, and share, because sharing is caring. And check out our previous episode on the cheapest breakfast sandwich in NYC. Deuces!